welcome back to my channel so in this video here i'm going to be doing a very huge walmart haul for you guys now this is everything that we got at walmart and there's some stuff that we've already opened and yeah so i threw away the packages on some of the stuff so the majority of the stuff that i can't show you guys we've already opened and threw away the packaging so without further ado let's go ahead and jump on into this video but before we do, go down and click that little subscribe button, turn on the little bell to be notified when I upload, and let's go ahead and jump on into this huge Walmart haul. Okay, so I have some stuff laying right here on the floor, and as you guys can see, I have my whole half of my bed right here completely full of stuff. So I'm just going to start off small bags and then get into the bigger things. So, And as always, before we start... We gotta have a nice cold L8. Okay, so the first bag right here that you guys are seeing, um, I bought the kids some new night cups and um, some cups for the car and stuff because you guys know that I got my car. Um, so the first pack of cups that I got right here is the Nook NUK brand. I don't know how to pronounce it. It says it's the nine month um, style cups. Um, they just look like this right here. So I figured these here would be uh, better for nighttime because you know they're bigger and stuff like that. So this is what they look like. Um, I forgot the price on these, but these are the kids' new nighttime cups. So let's see if I can get them to change from their old ones to these now obviously the purple is hers and the pink or the blue is his not the pink but the blue is his and the purple is hers so this is the first thing we got at walmart and then i got them two more cups well i got two more cups i should say and these here that i've got are for the car or the truck or whatever vehicle we're driving so pretty much what i mean is these two cups right here are going to stay in the vehicles uh, these are the Tommy Tippy. It's the same kind I got them last year, but different colors. And these have like little straw things to them. So it says they're the spill proof. And it's for 12 months for kids on the go, it says. So as you guys can see, so obviously hers is pink, his is gray. So, and like I said, these are for the car, truck, whatever vehicle we are in. That's what these are for. Um, I'm hoping that these work out really good and that they actually like these better than their 360 cups. So, I would use the 360 cups for, you know, going to the store and stuff like in a car or truck, but they like to spill too easy. It says they're spill proof, but they're not because they want to pick the rubber on it and then tip it over. You know how toddlers are if you got one. So, that's what they look like and most of this stuff I forgot the price on because this has been a few days ago that we went to Walmart <laughs> so except for some of the stuff I got last night so like I said these are those cups okay and then the next bag right here as you guys can see this bag we got last night so the first thing in this bag we got baby boy a Thomas and friends Nia train he picked this out himself. Um, this is a motorized one. I'm guessing so. I don't even know. But you can see where, you know, he was chewing on it at Walmart. Told him no. You know how toddlers are. But this is, like I said, the Thomas and Friends Nia train. So that's what this looks like. I'm sorry for the glare of my ring lights. So that's what that looks like. So. Obviously, got to open this for when they come in here when they wake up. Okay, the next thing we got is we got Fido some new jeans. And this is what they look like. Sorry if I'm getting like really washed out. It's because I'm still not used to this camera and all the, you know, quality changes of it and stuff. So, we got him some new jeans, as you guys can see right there. Um, and I, no, my Ellie spilt. Um, obviously these were $15.98 because the price is still on them, so. 
but I think actually these were on clearance. I'm not for sure. So, though is, though, there is one of his jeans. Okay, and then we got him another pair of jeans. These are the Georgia Slim. Um, obviously, they've texted me just now. So, these are what these look like. As you guys can see, these are skinny jeans. Uh, because sometimes throughout the week, he'll wear babe's jeans. So, because he really likes them. So, so those are his new pants. Next thing in these bag, well, this bag is I got me three new um, tank tops. So, I got like a coral color. Um, I got a army green color. And then I got, obviously, the color I always get, which is black. So, and these were uh, $3.98, I believe. Yeah, I'm going to say they were $3.98 because the price ain't on here. So, like I said, got me three new tank tops because I needed some new ones. And, you know, got uh, some plans coming up next week. So, that's what they look like. Okay, then the next bag, as you guys can see right here, Babe got uh, himself a plow troll. It's it's a minor bucket for fishing, if you guys don't know. Um, and this one has the little lock, I do believe, and then you pull it. This one's new from the what the one Babe has. Babe has the one that just snaps. Oh, this one goes on the inside, and then it has a little weight. Um, on the inside as you guys can see right there so that's what this is and I do remember that this was like four or five dollars so there's that one okay next bag here is I got this for the kids because you guys know when we had COVID you know obviously COVID symptoms are fever uh, so I got a dual scan prime infrared thermometer so, we needed one of these because those little dollar store thermometers that you stick in your mouth, they suck. It's not accurate. So, I was figuring that this right here, you know, you just hold it to their forehead and then it tells you their temperature. And it also says ear and forehead, food and liquid, bath water and nursery and home. So, I figured that this in here was a whole lot better than that one. And this was, I remember the price on this because... I used that uh, Walmart app for this, and this was $20. We needed it, so why not? Okay, so the next thing was in this bag, but I took it out of the bag. We got her a Minnie Mouse Sparkle and Sing Minnie Mouse. So I don't want to play it because I'm afraid they'll wake up because she's got supersonic hearing. But it says I sing Minnie, Minnie's Boos and, Bows and Tunes, if I could speak. And obviously, that's what this looks like. And like I said, also with the majority of the stuff um, that we ain't got the packaging for, it's because they've already opened it, which is some more toys and stuff. So there is Minnie there. She will absolutely love this. Uh, she wasn't with us when we picked this up because she was um, running around Babe, and I went ahead and picked this up because I know her with Minnie. Um, but. We're probably going to go back to Walmart later, so I'm going to let, her, let them pick out something else again today. So, there's many here. I, like I said, I would play it, but I'm not going to play it, and I think I hear them, so I think they're awake. <laughs> and Babe also picked these out for me. I was somewhere else in Walmart. I was looking at the other things, and Babe picked me up some spatulas um, because obviously we needed some new ones, and I got three of them here. And he said that they were $1.97, so I'm going to go with it. Um, so he got me like the tealish blue. It looks more like neon blue on camera. Um, I got gray. And then he picked me up a red one. So that was what that looks like. Now I can actually wash these and use them. Um, so there was that one. And then the last thing in this bag, I didn't really see the other day. Um... Until we started checking out. Then I saw this at Walmart. And I freaked out. Um, so you guys know me and Chucky right? So I finally found. A Chucky shirt. At Walmart. I didn't know Walmart sold Chucky shirts. Until I went. And then I seen this one. So 
And yes, I got a 3X. Uh, that's all the ones that I found that would actually fit me. Um, and the price tag is still on this one, and it was $7.88. So it is a 3X, and I'm super happy. I can tie it in the back um, and then wear it like that, which I am actually thinking about wearing today because you guys know me and Chucky. And it's like really thin. It's not like really thick like a normal t-shirt material. It's more like a spandex type material almost. Um, it's more like a tank top material. Like you guys can almost see completely through it. So like I said, I'm in love with it. I didn't know they sold it until we went to go check out. And you know how they had the clothesline area right there beside the checkout area. So that's why I've seen it and it was hanging up. So there's all that one. And then the next thing is in this bag, Bay picked his, uh, self up some new shoes because he definitely needed some new ones. Um, so he picked his stuff up some new shoes. That's what these look like. And these were $24. I didn't know the price of them. So I was like, oh, well, go ahead and get them. I don't care. So, and then when we got home, he told me, he goes, I don't know how much these were. So I went ahead and got them, like you said. And, but you guys can see they're $24. Um, but hopefully these will last him a little while. Well, at least a couple months. So, there's that one. Uh, sorry, guys. I was taking me a sip of that late. Um, the next bag. I'm going to start with way back here. And I got a oil filter for my car because it does need an oil change. And this is the Fram Oil Filter Tough Guard PG9837. So that's what this looks like. Um, so, and I'm going to be changing the oil this weekend. So that's what that looks like. For those of you that don't know what an oil filter looks like. And yes, there is going to be a video of that this weekend. Um, and then the next thing is I got baby boy some new shoes too because his feet is growing so big growing so big growing so much that you know his size five shoes are get too small now and too tight to put on so I got him a size six um she's in size eight her shoes are still perfect fit so if we go back to Walmart today I'm gonna get him some sandals because we're it's getting warmer out now and these were Fourteen eighty-seven because the price tag is still on there as well. So, and he loves, and I'll give you, he loves picking at the Velcro uh, every time he wears his shoes. Yep, they're awake. Every time he wears his shoes, he's got to pick at the Velcro, and I'm afraid that it's going to get um, not really sticking to itself anymore. That when he walks, the shoes are just going to come off. So I got these here. They're blue and black and white with a neon green strap right there it looks more neon on, on camera than what it actually is um so i got the ones without no velcro that just stretches right here so you can just they're slip on pretty much um so that is these and they have the little memory foam in there too so i'm hoping that he will like these so that's enough for on about shoes Okay, and then we went uh, back around to the electronics, and you know how they had the $5 bin of movies? Well, I found two movies that I really wanted, but the other one I didn't get because, you know, I didn't, I didn't want to get it, but I did get one. Um, you guys know me. I am obsessed with Halloween, Michael Myers, Chucky, whatever, so I got another Halloween movie. Um... I don't remember what year this one is, so, but as you guys can see, it, it's like, looks like one of the older um, Halloweens. I really don't know the years of Halloween, I just know Halloween when I actually start watching it, and I ain't watched this one yet, because um, like I said, some of these were from the other day, and some of this is from last night, so um, this one here is the one that says a Rob Zombie film Halloween. So, you guys can see. And this in here was $5. So, 
then, like I said, you guys know me in Halloween. You guys remember back in October, the new Halloween Kills movie come, came out. Your girl got Halloween Kills, the new one. Uh, this one I have already watched. And oh my god, I am obsessed with this one. I like this one, but, you know, I like the older ones better because I think the older ones are better because, you know, it's like older. I guess that's how you would say it. Um, but this one here includes two versions of the movie theatrical and extended with alter alternative ending. And you guys can actually see that this is the uh, 2021 movie. And yeah, and I am absolutely obsessed with this one. So you guys can see these are the only two movies that we got. Um, this one I think was a little bit more pricier because where it just not came out, it was like $15. Your girl had to get it because we all love Halloween in this in this house. Um, I have another Halloween over there behind the TV, so yeah. And then the last thing in this bag, Babe picked up for me because we needed another one, and he picked me up a iAudi, another smartphone mount for the car. Um, I have my one that I got when I got the gray Impala, which was my gray Ghost. I got that one. For the purpose of us if we ever get another vehicle and stuff and i took it out of the car when we gave the car back and stuff because like i said in the vlog it had a lot of mechanical problems so give me just a second guys sorry guys the doctor called for babe um but like i was saying i still have my old one that i got when i got the gray ghost but he picked this up for me i wasn't expecting it so i got another one for this one um because the one that goes in the truck, I have on the windshield of the car right now, so I can vlog. But this one's going to go on in the car, and then so is my other one whenever I get a chance to get to storage to get it. Because where we moved, it's in storage. Um, so, that's what it looks like. It ain't got the little bottom piece, it just looks like this. This is all it is, and then the part that goes on the windshield. So, or you can put it to your dash. I'm going to stick it to the windshield because I figured out that on the windshield, it sticks a lot better and it lasts a lot longer than what it does on the dash. So, I'm just going to use it on the windshield. Okay, two more things I wanted to add before I get on to the other bags is we got the kids a fishing pole. And it don't matter who's is who's here, but we got a Paw Patrol one. As you guys can see, it's Chase and I think it's Ryder. No, Ryder's the boy. Marshall, that's his name. Um, so we got them a little fishing pole. So, I mean, you guys can see. Um, and it comes with a little practice casting plug doohickey there. So um, I'm going to, I'll probably let them play with it like here in a little while since they ain't got no hooks or anything on it. I'm going to let them play with it here in just a little while when I bring them in here. Um, you know, we'll see what they do and I'll vlog it for you guys. So this is the first one. And then the other one that we got, we didn't know anything that we thought it was Minnie Mouse or another Paw Patrol one. But no, it's the PJ masks. They don't hardly like the PJ masks um, as well as they do Paw Patrol or Minnie Mouse. And that is louder. Ten times louder what it sounds to me. I don't know about you guys. Um, and it comes with that little thing again. So, as you guys can see. And I think they're actually going to love these. Um, I know she will know what to do. We'll have to teach him. So, I'm really excited to see, these, see them use these. Okay, the next bag that I'm going to show you guys is all fishing stuff. Um... Because Babe needed some new tackle for his tackle bag. Especially his brand new one. Um, so the first thing we got is a 7 inch fillet knife. You gotta be precise with that. So this is what it looks like. I'm the one who chose this out. Um, because black and gray looks good together. So I got black and gray and they had a red and black hand 
handle, so I figured black and gray would suit him better. And with me and him, we don't have a separate tackle bag or box or whatever. Me and him share, you know. We Everybody in the house shares except for Fido. He, he's got his own because he also catches uh, the bluegill for us for bait sometimes. So, that's what this one looks like. Uh, now, some of this shit, I don't know how to pronounce. I won't know hardly what it means because I'm still just now getting into fishing myself. So, bear with me. So, we got a bunch of these. Um, he's got different sizes. One is for, I think he said bluegill. Um, I know we got some more of these. Oh, here, somewhere. Yeah, here it is. Um, I, I remember him always getting these and he got the smells I guess that's what they're called that's what it says here on the paper and that's what they look like as you guys can see and it's by the brand Eagle Call um, so he got a couple of the little itty bitty size and then he got some of the little bit bigger size um, the size of these is two and then the size of the itty bitty ones are a six. So, I'm not really used to these. I'm used to the regular plain old plain Jane hooks. Another pack of the itty bitty ones. And then two more of the little bit bigger ones. So, um, I think in total he got six of these. He's got three of the small and three of the bigger ones. Uh, then we also got him a 8 inch stainless steel pliers, you know, to get the hooks out of the fish's mouth. Um, he got a braided nylon stringer for that little, he calls it minter bucket is what he calls it. So, we got another string. Um, but I didn't sound like somebody's out here. Okay, so there was nobody out there. Um, we got this here. It is a uh, thing, da, 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 bubble box portable air pump for on the go for when we're going to fishing. Um, it's one of the little filters, not filters, bubbler thing for the tank. I forgot what they're called. Um, he got a, another stringer. Um, he's got four spools of line right here he got two of the bright neon green and two of the dark green and the only kind he uses is the berkeley trawling big game as you guys can see this is the dark green right here and this is 20 pounds 25 pounds um and then so is the neon green the neon green one is mine i like the neon green i can see it better um and then now we're getting into the hooks and sinkers and bead and line stoppers, all that good guys. Um, so I'm just going to go through these little things really quick. These are the bullet weights, uh, cat pack, catfish sinkers. Uh, you guys should know what sinkers look like. Um, another one, I don't say, on this pack it don't say the like the of them and then he's got he got two packs of those um some more bullet weight cat packs these are flat i don't know if you guys can see them it looks like a diamond shape almost then he's got the regular um like look like eggs that's what i call them egg sinkers um he's got some of the eagle claw egg sinkers yep i've got egg sinkers <laughs> So, these here are three ounces, is what these two are. Um, I'm trying to move through these pretty quick because these, he's got a lot of these. Um, he's got another one of two ounces. Um, another pack that's three ounces. Um, another pack that is uh, by the Oz, Ozak Trail uh, for 1.5 ounces. Another one of the 1.5 ounces. Um, some more of those flat ones as you guys can see. Um, these little itty bitty ones right here, these are the tiny ones. 
not really tiny, but the three quarter ounce, or three fourths ounce, so to speak. Um, he's got some more of the 1.5 ounces. Um, next, we have another one of the 1.5 ounces. I didn't know how many of those he got. Um, I went with him when he got those. Then he got some more of these fluorescent beads. Um, these are the tackle beacon. They could, however, look like this. Um, these are the soft lock string bobber stops. So he's got those. Um, he's got these rigged twirl tails, I guess, for uh, bluegill fishing to the river. Um, now we're getting into his, oops, oops another one of the 1.5 ounces. Now, that is everything in that bag except for what I got in my hand. Um, these are the brand Team Catfish hooks. Um, these are the size 8. Right here, he only uses the 8 or 9 uh, circle hooks. Um, so, he's got those. He's got Another pack of the nines, which these comes with, now these are eights. These here comes with nine, as you guys can see. Um, and then he's got another pack of the eights that comes with three. And then another pack of the size eight that comes with three. So, you guys can see, he's got a, he's got an ass ton of tackle. So... Okay, anyways, what I was saying, you guys can see that he's got an ass ton of tackle. Just all that much. So, uh, plus he's got some more stuff over here in this bag. But it ain't Walmart, but I'm going to go ahead and show you guys. Okay, it ain't Walmart, but... Ah! I'm going to go ahead and show you guys. Um, these straw floater zimmer floppies. Um, we got this at... TNT Tackle in Grayson. It's Tussie and Tussie Outdoors in Grayson, if you guys know where that is. Um, that's where we got these from. And he's got all these. So he's got two white and orange, yellow, and two orange. So he's got five of these in total. And obviously, you can cut them down. Um, and then he's got one, two, three, four, five, six. He's got six um, floaters right here. So he only uses the size 12 floaters, like the 12 inch floaters. I'm trying to see if this is 12 inch. Anyways, he's got six, five or six of these. I just don't count these. So um, then he's got another floater here. And this and here comes with the free line threader. And this and looks like that. So that's what everything he got at for tackle, you guys should say. Um, so that is everything for like tackle and all that good jazz. So I'm gonna clean this little mess up and I'll be right back. Okay, so then the last couple of things I have for you guys that we got at Walmart is over here on this side of me. So let me take a little sip. Okay, now you guys know that I got the car, blah, blah, blah. So we got this here to change the oil in the car. And this is the Castor GTX high mileage. Uh, and it's the 10W30. So... This is kind of all my car takes, so I know for most cars it's different. Um, it sounds the same, but this is the kind that Babe likes using. It's it gives more. I don't know how he said it, but you guys know what I'm trying to say. It's a lot better, he thinks. Um, so there's that one, and then we also got um, the washer fluid stuff, and this is the Ranix two in one all season windshield washer fluid. So. We got the all season one and yeah. So there's really nothing much to say about that except for my washer fluid thing is low. And then you guys know last year I had my cat daddy pose. So
so he uh, he went and picked me up two more of my cat daddy pose. Um, so this is what it looks like. Hang on, I'll show you guys. So this is what the cat daddy pose looks like. Like I said, this is also from Walmart, um, but you can also get it at TNT Tackle and Grayson. Um, so, so you guys know, you guys know what I'm talking about. So, and then it just feels like it when you do the thing. Um, and this was at Walmart because the price tag's still on here. It's the Cat Daddy Spinning Combo. Is what it says. I think the price tag is still on here. So, and this was $24. I do remember that. So, um, I can't really show you guys how long this, this bad boy is. Uh, because it is pretty well, pretty well long. Um, but you guys get... You guys get the point. It reaches all the way from the camera to the window. So, you guys, you guys get the gist on how long these hugs are. And then, I got another one right there. And that was just at Walmart. $24 for two of the cat daddies. So, 40 some dollars for two poles. Which... Which is a better steal than what I thought. Okay, so the next thing that we got, like I said, we got the kids some other stuff too, but they've already got it in their room. So, the next thing we got is him another tackle bag. And this boy is pretty well huge. <laughs> it's got the little tray up here. It's got front and side pockets. It looks like this that he can stick the whatever in like snacks or whatever if he's not fishing the mirror whatever um then this little piece folds around like this and then you can like i guess fillet the fish over here whatever you guys want to do uh, or whatever your little heart desires um and this thing when i say it is huge on the inside let let me tell you, it's almost like a suitcase. So, when I say it is huge, you got a pocket up here. You got four of the little storage drawers, and these bad boys are pretty freaking huge. Um, so, you got four of them in here, and then you got that much room, and then there's little side pockets right here, too. Um, so, if you guys want one of these tackle bags like he's got, it was $44. Yeah, $44. So, and he wanted it, so I got it for him. And then you got another side pocket here on the side. You got a back pocket, another side pocket. And this is by the brand Ozark. Trail all outdoor equipment pro large quick access tackle bag. Um, so it is, it is really huge. So there's the tag if you guys want to go get you guys one. So that's what that's what this beast looks like, and it is kind of pretty heavy without everything in it. And I know him when he gets home from work, he's gonna fill this bad boy up. So. There you guys go on that. Okay, so next thing I got is I got some copy paper right here. And this is just a pin gear copy paper. Uh, I got 500 sheets for $4 and something. The reason why I got this is because the very last thing in this Walmart haul I got is I got me... A printer I've been aiming to get me a printer for the last two years and every time I go to get one it's not on sale it's not in stock or I never have the money to actually get it so I said piss on it I'm gonna go ahead and get it 
and this was $44. So, this is a Canon Pixmy MG2522. It's just a regular desktop printer. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to hook this up to the laptop, set it in the kitchen for everybody to use. It's what if we need it for, you know, him to go to school, him for work, me for, you know, jobs or whatever. It's right there. I won't have to keep going to the library and printing papers off. So, that is everything that I have for you guys in this Walmart haul. Now, like I said, I want to go back to Walmart tonight and do a couple more things that we forgot. So, I will see you guys in the next clip. Like I said, that is everything in this Walmart haul. I know it was pretty huge, and I know it seemed like, you know, we got a lot more stuff for ourselves and stuff, but, you know, we got everybody something, so that's all that counts, and we got the bills paid. We got a new vehicle. That's the main thing that was our goal right there, was to get the bills paid up till next month and get a vehicle. That was our two goals, mainly. Um... But yeah, we've got everything so far that we've actually need for this fishing season. Um, remember to go check out Babe's channel. I will leave it linked in the description box. And if not, you guys can just go to my profile and go to um, my pages and stuff. And it's Beeman's Catfishing Adventures. There is our YouTube channel name. Well, it's his channel. So yeah, if you guys like this video, be sure to go down there and hit that thumbs up button. It really helps out. And be sure to go down and hit that little red subscribe button because that helps out so, so much. And give it a big thumbs up. And I hope you guys have a wonderful day. And I will see you guys in my next video. Um, I don't think I will actually record what else, like an actual haul on what else we get if we go to Walmart today. It's just going to be one of them things that I'm, I'm just going to show you guys like a little quick video and not an actual haul. So... I guess I will see you guys in my next video. I'm going to clean up my mess here and start hooking this printer to the laptop. That's the way I can bring the kids in here because like I said, well, go, they woke up. And they can watch Curious George. So I will see you guys in my next video. I love you guys. Bye.